Hi guys, my name is Siege and I'm going to show you a couple tips and tricks how you can build your own medieval house in Minecraft. So let's get straight on with it. So as you can see I marked out a 21 by 21 area, so I can actually build on 19 by 19 blocks. At first I'm going to landscape a tiny bit so the house doesn't stand on a totally flat area. I'm now going to mark the basic shape of the house. By building up the logs, I get a better feel for the general structure of the building. Don't force your buildings into the landscape. Try and build them around it. This will get you a more realistic looking house. You can see another example for that over here. Now I'm adding the support beams, where also the second floor will sit on. Over here I'm marking the general shape of the roof again with logs. The other side was a little trickier because of the shape of the ground floor. Now I'm starting to add the outer rim of the roof. In these kind of small houses I tend to use oak wood for the outlines and spruce wood for the main part of the roof. I'm trying to add a little bit of detail with replacing the full blocks with stairs so the roof doesn't look so flat. Like I said earlier, now I'm going to fill in the main part of the roof with spruce wood. Now I'm chopping away a couple of blocks to give the roof a slight hang so it looks really old. This gives the house a lot of character. Now I'm letting the roof look like it's a little worn down. This is basically a try and error process. To detail the walls, I'm using a mixture of cobblestone blocks, stairs, slabs and walls. I'm going to mix in clean stone and andesite for further detail.
I quickly clean that up from the inside. This already looks like a pretty nice medieval house. If you want you can leave it like this. You'd have to fill in the walls of the second floor of course, but I'm going to take that building a step further by adding some more detail to the roof. But let me build the walls up first. Although green is not my favorite color, I like to use the lime and dark green clay because it fits quite well with the overall theme. I'm now adding in a bit of dark oak wood as little patches that have been repaired. As you can see, I'm adding some more detail with trapdoors, buttons, signs and ladders, but I couldn't really get a good design going, so I decided to remove the ladders and replace everything until it fits. I'm now adding a couple of bumps and hiccups to the outer rim of the roof so it doesn't look so clean. I'm also placing slabs and stairs under the rim, so it gives the effect of a hanging down roof. I went around and placed some slabs onto the roof, but I didn't actually like that, so I replaced the slabs with rotated stairs. I'm now adding in the chimney and I also tried some stuff with smoke but it didn't really work out the way I wanted it to so I just saved that for another day. To detail the walls of the second story I just place in a couple of spruce wood stairs and slabs. As a final touch up I go around and place fence posts under each lock poking out, put the door in place and I go around once more to add some support with slabs and stairs made from spruce wood where it makes sense. And there you have it guys, you can now make your own awesome looking medieval house in your Minecraft survival world. If you liked this video, please be sure to hit the like button down below, subscribe to not miss out on future videos and share this video with your friends. Until then, take care and I'll see you in the next video.